back to my channel or welcome if you are new my name is lauren if you didn't already know it's gonna i don't really know how i'm gonna do this video i won't lie i got asked in a youtube comment and i was thinking of doing it anyway um so here i am taking the plunge and actually doing it i want to give some tips advice show you how i do lecture you notes know, online learning lectures Today, in my little bullet journal, I had planned to... Ooh, I was meant to do that, actually. I'll do it later. Oh, I need to do that as well. One thing I'm going to do right now, though, is week three. We're on teaching week three. Um, social and cognitive psychology lecture. As I said, I don't, I don't really know how this video is going to look. I am a solid 2-1 student. I get a first in a couple things, not many things. I think I got a first in one of my exams. Other than that, I get 2-1s, which is good. Pretty happy with it, I guess, I think. So if you're wanting to get a first, which is I, what I want, I want to get a first too. And to be honest, I feel like my lecture note taking is fine. It's just the revision aspect that I need to work on. If you're wanting a first, Please still watch anyway and just adapt to make it better. And let me know because I would like it first as well. I probably should stop blabbing on. So I go to my Canvas page first. And uh, this is where they upload all their lectures and things. And I'll go to find this week's learning material. And here we are. So apparently this week is on attachment. Which I'm hoping won't be a redo of A level because that's gonna be inconvenient. This lecturer I actually had last year for a different module and his PowerPoints and his lectures are so nicely laid out. He is honestly like, such a great lecturer. But essentially what I do is I get the slides, download them. So I've got my PowerPoint down here downloading. It's taking ages and I think it's because of my Wi-Fi, which is straight in. In the meantime I'm gonna, I like to work on Google Drive so I'll go to my social and cognitive folder and here you can see that I've got my lecture for week two that we had. Week one we didn't have any teaching and I'll just create a new document and as you can see there's a little these are all the slides, but I prefer to download it on PowerPoint so then I can change the backgrounds to my lovely my lovely orange colour. As you can see, they put like an estimated time for how long it's gonna take everything. So mini lecture one takes 30 minutes apparently. It definitely won't. It's gonna take a lot longer. Here it is, the lovely lecture. And I'm gonna do part one. And what I often do is this is like just the stage where I make notes based on this PowerPoint. So for like this slide, I'll literally just like highlight the pictures, paste, and kind of do that thing for pictures for other slides. For this slide, where it's mainly text, I'll make notes based on this, make sure I get those keywords that are in bold, and I put those in italics. And whilst I make notes on the PowerPoint, I like to listen to, oh, you can see me in the reflection, hey. I like to listen to a podcast or just music in general. I'm gonna listen to this podcast by Naina Florence, slow fashion and dressing sustainably. Get speeding through this, because I wanna get the lunch done today. And at one o'clock, we're doing pancakes, because it is pancake day. Hey guys, welcome back to Growing With The Flow. <laughs> Have you got your gluten, egg, we've got gluten free, dairy free, egg free mixture. Summer. 
It's considerably later in the day now and I'm up to the next like stage if you will of my note taking so I'll show you what I do. Here is a Panopto recording of my lecture and here is my notes for the first part of the lecture. As you can see there's screenshots, there's a few notes a spelling error, a few screenshots of quotes, a graph here and essentially what I'm now gonna do in a different font colour I like to do red just because it's easy I'm gonna listen to the Panopto recording there's my lecturer which I'll just quickly take off the screen because I don't know how much you'd appreciate being put on YouTube but yeah I'll listen to my lecture and add in notes um, to anything that's added, so like especially for this slide here. Obviously he's going to talk a bit about whatever this has got to do with. There's no text on that slide, so there'll probably be a few notes for me to write down from this slide. Yeah, it kind of just goes on like that for the whole video, and it's 30 minutes long. Central to attachment theory is the idea that early caregiver... <laughs> Okay, so this lecture is completely done, which I'm very happy about. And now I basically repeat the same process for all three parts of the lecture. So I've already got my little part two written down here. Um, there, all the red is basically the notes I added during that lecture. Quite a lot for this slide, as you can see. Um, ooh, forgot any enough. Um, but yeah, I'm now going to do the notes from a PowerPoint slide for part two, do it here, and then listen to it after I've done those notes. So I just wanted to say how this is another one of my most favourite podcasts. Um, I'm about to listen to the episode they released today, which is a uh, part two to their previous one from last week. This video was helpful, especially the person that actually asked me to, and also back when I did my Q&A, I think someone asked me how I study. So I hope it was helpful in a certain way. I'm really sorry if it wasn't clear, but thank you so, so much for watching this video. If you did like it, give it a thumbs up. And if you wanna see some more stuff from me, you can subscribe and let me know what other videos you wanna see. If you wanna see more, university related things whether it's studying or just like day in the lives or like um i'm thinking of doing like what i spend in a week maybe that would be kind of interesting kind of nosy like me then you might like that i just got onto my channel i know 300 subscribers thank you so so much for 300 subscribers that's like actually insane ah okay well um 
if you want to join those 300 people and subscribe, you can do. That would be really cool. Um, and I shall see you in another video. Am I wrong?